Hey guys, got a big old box here. It's going to be the unboxing of my new Bell helmet. Um, I've looked a lot on YouTube and so far I haven't found one that actually had the qualifier with the, uh, the blue and yellow, uh, what is that, blue torque, I believe it's called, the color scheme. So uh, let me get something sharp here and we'll get to work. A little herring knife action ought to do it. I got this off of eBay, uh, one of their listings. If you go on there, you'll find a bunch of them that have uh, you know, your color, your size. Uh, it took me a lot of digging to actually find one that had a, uh, a selector or a slider actually on the uh, eBay page to be able to pick your uh, pick an extra visor if you wanted to. So the, the helmet itself is about $109 retail. Uh, you'll find free shipping just about anywhere. However, what you can't find is uh, a deal, package deal with the helmet and the visor. This company, and that was, uh, the seller was memory underscore bank. There you go, $169.95. The helmet and uh, the extra visor, you see. Uh, it comes with the clear helmet and the clear uh, visor as well. Actually, it's a box inside a box. Isn't that nice? All right, choice of professionals. Nice little bell helmet box. There you go, the uh, torque blue and yellow qualifier. It's not the DLX, it's just the base. I'm actually doing autocross in a car. So while I have a bunch of motorcycle helmets, uh, they're kind of old. I wanted something brand new than it was actually my size, which is... Uh, about 59 and a half uh, centimeters. I heard these are all a little small, so usually I go for extra large, maybe. Um, the large just seemed like a good idea. And if you watch some reviews on this helmet, which I'm sure you have if you're watching this video, these things have really good reviews. They have uh, speaker pockets, they have uh, really nice airflow, and they have a ton of colors that you get to pick from. There's the uh, separate shield there. In the back. Beautiful bag. Oh my god, this is a lot more plush than I expected actually. This material is really breathable and really, really plush. So that wasn't as bad as not as I thought it was going to be because I watched another review of one of these helmets. Uh, and it was tied in a crazy knot. You have to forget my allergies too. I'm gonna sniff a lot. Alright, so we're inside of a nice little wrapping here. That is a lot brighter than I expected. Oh my god. That's beautiful. Silica packet. That happened in the other guy's video too that I watched. That's pretty funny. So yeah, I will be running uh, autocross this weekend, barring if it doesn't uh, actually rain us out, which would be really bad. Um, because I ordered this in time for us to go autocross. The next one isn't for two months. So, either way, here is the torque, the blue torque with the yellow, what it actually looks like, straight out of the box with the little thing hanging there. That's nice. DOT FMVSS number 218 certified ECE 2205. So beautiful there. Oh my god, the headliner's gorgeous. Let's got these little speaker pockets up in there. Very nice. All right. So the clear shield, obviously. Let's see if I can actually get this thing on my head, which would be great. Although I do have the uh, a nice little snap. That's nice. Excellent. So hopefully that doesn't get in my way. Oh yeah. Perfect fit, guys. Absolutely. Perfect fit. That is a nice helmet. It's snug, but not too snug. And actually, the liner actually in these is 
it comes out. Beautiful. Now, standard clear, it's not the transition. Uh, this is the Bell parts and accessories here. This is the blue iridium uh, face shield that I got with it. And while these run about $65, if you do the math on the helmet plus this at 100 and just under 170, the helmet's supposed to be 110, and this is supposed to be an extra 65, and I got it all for 170, so I saved a little bit of money. Uh, so I would recommend going for these guys because they got it here very quickly. Again, that's memory underscore bank. That was the seller. These helmets have the quick release system. And it's got a protective shield on it, of course. I don't know what to take off of there in a minute because I am going to swap this over. But you can just see the uh, effect. Now in the daytime, this would show up a whole lot better. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get this off and not do any damage to this thing, of course. But again, Bell qualifier, the standard Bell qualifier. Beautiful helmet. And uh, yeah, I would recommend you guys getting one. If you're looking for autocross, if you're looking for motorcycle, if you're looking for street use, racing use, they are DOT and ECE. They are not um, Snell certified, but I've heard ones that would pass Snell, wouldn't pass DOT and vice versa. So uh, at $110 helmet, you're getting a lot for what you're, uh, what you're paying. And I wouldn't go any cheaper than this, honestly. I've looked around. You get you two vents here at the top. The nice mesh at the back. Again, mesh here, mesh here. Just a beautiful helmet. There's a shot inside for you guys. All right, so thank you. And uh, can't wait to give this guy a try. Hopefully it don't get rained out this weekend, but I will be uh, doing some autocross later with this thing. Uh, now I gotta get the girlfriend one. Thanks guys.